Hello, folks. My name is Detroit Miracle. Yeah, and you can believe that fact, too. Well, I'll try to be as brief as I possibly can because it is very late at night. Hey, the fact that it is extremely late in the morning or early in the morning, it doesn't really prevent me from doing what I have to do. Yeah, folks, if I got to bring all of you the informity, I am willing to sacrifice my sleep in order to do that. Because I'm the friend buddy type to many of you. Okay, I'm going to talk a little bit about real life moments which are free and uncontained as well as captured moments of real life which are stored. Okay, well, you know, when you go outside and perceive things out of your eyes, you are actually seeing them in the all realness of the actuality. Yeah, that is actually what is happening at that time or any place when you on look any event through your optics or eyes. Yeah. Now, on the other hand, when they capture a moment on camera by putting a viewer screen in front of those moments, which can be later seen by you, or even if they do it on a live feed where a screen is in front of those real sets of circumstances, then in all technical terms, you are not getting the full 100% of the realness of life in all actuality because there is something over it in which sort of blocks out the fullness of it. <laughs> yeah. Like if you watch the live news and you're sitting in front of your screen and the news lady or news guy shows you a live event at some location, even though that such thing appears real and clear, it is still not the full and richness of the real realness which is happening at that moment because a viewer screen sort of takes away from it now, if you are actually there viewing it and looking at it as it is, then you're getting the 100% of that moment. Yeah, people. But if you watch something which was taped in the realness of life and it was contained and stored, then even though you can view that event, which might have a clear picture, nevertheless, it isn't real or it isn't real of the all actuality as you would perceive things yourself by being there at that moment. <laughs> yeah, folks, it is not confusing. It is not tricky. It is simply the case of that matter and those matters. And it does matter. Yeah, because when you look through a screen to capture live moments, then you're not capturing the fullness or you're not getting the fullness of it or you will not be showing the full 100 realness of life because others will simply watch something of life and in life, which was captured, bottled, contained, and stored for later viewing purposes. Yeah, folks, don't go into a panic because you can still get life 
in the full and at any moment, at any time that you are viewing something and actually living through those moments while being there yourself in the flesh. Yeah, that is something else to think about, people. And I'd appreciate it if you give me those likes, comments, and subscriptions to my channel. And peace out, folks.